Very windy. I'm just hoping the law got as lost as we did. There! Arthur! Any luck? I found a place where we can get some shelter. Let Davy rest while he... You know... An old mine in town. Abandoned. It ain't far. Come on. Come on! Yeah! yourselves warm. Stay strong. Stay with me. We ain't done yet. Come on, Arthur. All right. We've got some work well, to do. We ain't run into them yet, so they both must have headed down the hill. Sure. Hey, I ain't had time to ask. What really went down back there on that boat? We miss you. That's what happened. Come on. Oh. Hey, you need horses? Oh, yeah. Hey, Mr. Smith, get yourself indoors. You need to rest that hand. I'll live. Get indoors, son. I... We need you strong. OK. Oh, we're playing as author. Oh. Sweet. All right, let's head out. Ain't sure what we're gonna find out here, Dutch. We have to try. Stay close and we'll do our best to stick to the trail. This goddamn weather! <laughs> Careful over this bridge here. A bridge. Ooh, the troll just vibrated when he bumped into me. Okay. Oh, always because we're getting too close to him. Oh, horses reaction. Believe we lost Davy too. He's the last one, Arthur. No more. We need to get those people warm and fed. At least we don't need to worry about Pinkerton's tailing us in this. You up ahead. Who's there? Micah. Gentlemen. Found anything? I think so. Found a little homestead down that way. Okay. Move up, Arthur. I'll cover the rear. I'm trying to stay in the middle. There we go. That should be good enough. <laughs> go and explore it, but set me now. Oh, those are options to say, isn't it? You run into anybody else? I, I reckon we're the only ones crazy enough to be out in this, Morgan. Okay. Let's head down there. Coming through. Yeah, okay. Watch out. 
Let me handle this. We don't want to spook these fine people. Sounds like quite the party. You two, get yourself out of sight. One lonely man is a lot less intimidating than three nasty-looking degenerates. Arthur, in that cattle shed on the left. Micah, get down behind that wagon in front. and I, well, we got into some trouble up the way, lost in the storm. Ah, gentlemen. We can't help you, mister. I got folks. Arthur. Dying on the trail. Arthur, we got a problem. Folks. <laughs> There's a corpse right here. No, I, I just Arthur. need some There's a body food in the wagon. I hear you. Just gentlemen. keep your eyes on Dutch. Please. Please. Look out! This upside down grab as many supplies as you can we need the essentials food medicine whiskey I don't really want us to split up huh oh. looks like the poor bastard was married too at some point if we can't eat it or drink it, put it down. I'm going to start packing the horses. You keep looking. Um, this is so cool. Like, you're actually looting stuff as well. I like this. Oh, I didn't mean to put the ladder. I want to look over here. What do we have over here? Sexy. It's hard to see because I can't see the buttons all the time. I can see them on the right, but I don't know which one is which. But it's mainly gonna be X. I gather. Climbing up. Um. No. <laughs> I think it was on a Tuesday or something. But it's not Tuesday, it's Friday. Okay. That looks like it. that's it. Seems. Um, I think I scouted the whole area. I think I drained it dry. Micah, Arthur, keep looking for stuff. Arthur, go see if there's anything in that barn. Micah, you search the cabin, see what we missed. Oh, did he now? 
Sneaky little bastard. Should I kill him? No. Not yet. Find out what they're doing here and where Colm is. Oh, this son of a bitch will talk. <laughs> Get the hell out of here. Go. Oh, let him go. I didn't mean to. Okay. <laughs> to be having a hat. Sex, yeah. And hold on. <laughs> First soul, Mrs. Adler. Miss Tilly, Miss Karen, would you warm her up? Give her a drink or something. And Mrs. Adler, it's gonna be okay. You're safe now. They turned her into a widow. Animals. I need some rest. I haven't slept in three days. You're over here. Miss O'Shea will show you the way. Miss no Morgan, way. we put you in a room over here. Thank you, Miss Grimshaw. Mr. Bell, you're with the fellas over there. What? Well, how come Arthur gets a room and I get a bunk bed next to Bill Williamson and a bunch of darkies? Get yourself to bed. <laughs> I'm sorry to ask, but... It's little John. He's got himself caught into a scrape again. He ain't been seen in two... Two days. Your John will be fine. I mean, he may be as dumb as rocks and as dull as rusted iron, but that ain't changing because he got caught in some snowstorm. Please go take a look. Javier? Yes. Javier, will you ride out with Arthur <clears throat> to take a look for John? <clears throat> You're the two best fit men we've got. Now? She's... We're all... Yeah, we're pretty worried about him. I know the situation were reversed and he looked for me thank you Let's see if he can hear us. Come on. Up there. Uh, somewhere. I don't think we can go much further on the horses. We'll have to walk from here. I grabbed that shotgun from your horse. Who knows what's up ahead? I just flipping okay. Is it what the fuck are you doing? Okay, let me see what button it is. Hold LB, LT. Oh, I got two weapons. This way. High up here. You're telling me. Well, we eagles. Careful. 
There's a drop here. Oi, Jenny boy, we're coming for you. Even though you're dumb as hell, apparently. Damn, it's cold. <laughs> How you doing? I'm miserable. Been a tough few days. I know. Here, take a drink of that. Thanks. I'm not designed for this snow. Over here! All right! Hot down, Marston! Is it John Marston? That's quite a scratch you got there. Never thought I'd say this, but good to see you, Arthur Morgan. Oh my god! Oh my god! You don't look so good. I don't feel too good, neither. I'm freezing. Don't die just yet, cowboy. Come on, compadre. Well, we can't go back the way we came. Let's try this way. Ain't you a sorry sight? Can't argue with you there. See, I told Dutch you weren't the right man for this. I'm sure you did. Okay, here we go, John. We'll leave them to Arthur. Shelter now. So what are we doing now? It's just like free room now. I don't know what's going on. So what I'm gonna do is check the map. So we got two things. That's quite cool. I love this. I'm so glad it came out. So, I think I'll do these two missions, and we'll see what happens afterwards. Let's go with the shotgun. Are you hearing me? You're going to need that rifle. I got it! Come on, let's go. Fudge! <laughs> Seems Dude. easiest to take the same path down as Bill and Micah. Like you said... So, so far, this has actually been quite fun. I'm enjoying this. Even though it's still at the start, it's still slow, but it's fun. And plus, knowing that this is the actual past before John Marson was pretty much kicked out of a gang sort of thing. And this, this is, this is starting to be interesting. And plus, apparently, it's a black border. And I have a map from my game, and it has the actual old map on there. Like, part of the old map is part of everything else. Which is going to be awesome. Down through these trees, quick. Guard duty. 
That's funny. Stay low. Come on, follow me. Pick you up right here. Just isn't your I'm no use to you, really. Please don't. Oh, God, no. I keep on mounting the horse. Stop mounting the horse. Pick up. Hey, dude. You got me mixed up with someone else. Oh, it's X. <clears throat> oh, yeah, why was Lou? <clears throat> please, please, you don't need to do this. I <laughs> just dropped him. I <laughs> get dropped. <laughs> When I can't see the flipping things. I'll get used to this game one way or another. What's your name, boy? I don't know. In a couple of months. Are you trying to test me? Is that it? Because I will break every bone in your body. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Not one more goddamn word. Am I clear? Okay. Okay. That's two bones right there. <laughs> Dude. Dude. That's two bones right there. Oh, didn't get the fellow chance. Supplies in. 
Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. <laughs> I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Move quietly and slowly. Got it. You see the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. Oh my god, that's so cool! Are we meant to say crouch? Or can we just walk? Now most likely we're gonna scare them off. Wait, look. There they are. Quick, get that bow out, Arthur. Try to hit him in the neck or head. Quick and clean. Oh my god, can I can back quite hard. You'll feel when it's too much. Take the shot. Good shot. Now let's try for another. Got it. Well done. I think that's all we can carry. Okay, you pick up one, I'll get the other. You sure your hand's okay? Uh, it'll be fine once I get it on my shoulder. Damn! And we're covering well, snow. Well, well. <clears throat> Just drop it down in here. <clears throat> what a surprise. I found a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid you. He loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Navy rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. I'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <laughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. A few days later. It's been a bad few weeks. <laughs> Dutch. Being Dutch, he is busy making plans, and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. But for the moment, just rest. Arthur. I think it's time for the train. Want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch. Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. <laughs> Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? The weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Jose? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea, we're living. Look at me. We're living, even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just, I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. 
What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutch. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? Yeah, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. <laughs> <laughs>